Ever wonder how to get your PDFs to be fillable so that people can fill them out right on their computer or their tablet? Well, stick around because I'm gonna show you how to create these fillable PDFs using 100% free tools and in less than three minutes. Hey, my name is Amanda and on my channel, I help creatives and coaches just like you get more leads and more sales for their online business. So if that sounds like something you want to do more of, then make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any new videos. Okay, so before we dive into this tutorial, I want to let you know what tools we're going to be using. So we're going to be using a free tool called PDF Escape. The cool thing about PDF Escape is that it allows you to create these fillable forms within minutes and it is completely free. Also, I wanna make sure that you have your PDF designed and ready to go. And if you need help designing a beautiful PDF, I'm gonna link my video right above here so that you can go over there and do that first. Okay, let's dive in. Okay, so I am here on pdfescape.com and I'll pop the link in the description below so that you guys can hop right over there. Um, but this is going to be a super fast tutorial. You guys are gonna be amazed at how quickly you can actually create these fillable PDFs and it does not require Adobe Acrobat, which a lot of people don't have. So um, before we dive in, I wanna show you what PDF I'm working with because you wanna make sure that you have this PDF already created before you upload it to PDF Escape. So I'm just gonna show you what I have here. So I've created this PDF right here for a client and you can see on here, I'll show you, I've created these questions and these boxes. So this kind of shows you where the text is going to be. And I've done this on every page that I need to add a text box to. Now you don't have to create these boxes for where you want them to write, but this is for if they go to print the page out, they know where those boxes are, but you don't even need those because when we upload it into PDF Escape, you'll see that you actually create those boxes right inside of the program. So that is the PDF that I'm working with. So when you get here to this um, home screen right here, you can either choose file or you can just drag your PDF right over there, which is what I'm gonna do. Okay, so it's just going to pull up my PDF and generate all of the pages so you can go through here and kind of see what's going on. So like I said, this is going to be super easy, you guys. So just go to the page where you need to add a fillable form or fillable text box for people. And you're going to go over here to form field. And then you're going to choose the type of form field. So you've got a few different options here. You can do checkbox, uh, drop down, um, the ones that you'll probably be using the most are these top three, text, text paragraph, and checkbox. Text is really just like one single line of text. Text paragraph is more than one line of text. So I'm gonna choose text paragraph, and then hit select, and then you are going to just click and drag for where you want your box to be. Once you have the box drawn, you can also change the settings on here by selecting it and then going up to this little tool icon and you can name it if you want. You can do read only, require, depending on like what you actually need people to do on your form, you can change it, uh, alignment, you can change the alignment there, do not scroll, whatever the properties are that you wanna set for that, you can do that right there. And what you're gonna wanna do is again, just go text paragraph, select, and then just keep dragging. Um, and then I'll show you, we're gonna go down to the next page and even for these larger ones right here, um, same thing, super easy. So form field, text paragraph select, and then uh, just drag however long you need it. So then when you're all set, you're gonna go over here to this uh, two green arrows and you're gonna go save and download PDF. And then it's gonna download it right to your computer. And if you have Acrobat, Adobe Acrobat installed, it's just going to open it right in your program. And I will show you how this works. So now you can see on here, it has a box and I can just type right in here my answers. There you go. And that's how you do it. And that's it, super easy, right? Comment below and let me know if you gave this a shot. And if you like this video, hit that like button, share it with your friends, and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any new videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.